Hi students, welcome to our physics class. Now in this class we are going to learn about the differences between speed and velocity. It is the topic in 9th class physics in motion chapter. And also useful in 10 plus 1 that is 11th class physics, intermediate first year physics in a motion in a straight line. So what about a speed and velocity? Speed is a nothing but distance travelled by the body. So distance travelled by the body per unit time is called to speed. The unit time you may take as a one second or one minute or one hour like that students. So what is the distance travelled by the body per unit time is called to speed. But whereas displacement made by the body displacement made by the body per unit time is called velocity is called velocity but you know the differences between distance and displacement we explained in the previous video so you can see and you can understand clearly what are the differences between distance and displacement so you since distance is a scalar quantity displacement is a vector quantity so speed Speed is a vector, scalar quantity, speed is a scalar quantity, velocity is a vector quantity, since displacement is a vector, since distance is a scalar, so distance is a scalar, speed is a scalar, displacement is a vector, it is a, velocity is a vector, so speed is a given by the formula distance by time, distance by time. Or it can be written as V is equals to S by T. Velocity is given by the formula displacement by time. Displacement by time. So you know velocity is a vector. So it can be denoted by V bar. Displacement is a vector. It is denoted by S bar. And time is a scalar. So S bar by T bar. But magnitude of velocity can be written as magnitude of velocity means that letting the direction you are taking only magnitude magnitude of velocity can be written as v is equals to s by t that is magnitude of displacement by time but it is a uh, here both magnitude and directions are mentioned only magnitude so magnitude of velocity equal to speed speed is equals to magnitude of velocity magnitude of velocity magnitude of velocity is equals to magnitude of velocity is equals to speed but how can we understand this is for example a car is a moving a car is a moving from the direction a to b with 80 kilometer per hour 80 kilometer per hour speed a car is a moving from the direction A to B, A to B with a speed 80 km per hour. Then, so in this one students, what is the speed of the car means? You can give answer simply 80 km per hour because it is only speed is, speed has, speed is nothing but so distance travelled by the body per unit time, it is a scalar, it has only magnitude. So magnitude, magnitude of velocity 80 km per hour and the speed is also 80 km per hour. So we don't want to tell 80 km per hour from A to B because A to B is the direction. 80 km per hour is representing magnitude of velocity or simply speed. So what is the speed of the car means? You can say simply 80 km per hour. Then what is the magnitude of velocity? Suppose what is the magnitude of velocity of the car what is the magnitude of velocity of the car so from this statement what is the magnitude of velocity of the car means simply it is also 80 kilometer per hour 80 kilometer per hour so magnitude of velocity magnitude of velocity means so this is this value which is also equal to speed but magnitude of velocity means so only we want to take a speed without a direction. So magnitude of velocity is 80 km per hour. Then what is the velocity of the car? What is the velocity of the car? 
So velocity of the car means you want to say 80 km per hour from A to B. It is a direction, it is a magnitude. So velocity means both it has magnitude and direction. So magnitude is magnitude of velocity 80 km per hour and direction is from A to B. You want to tell both because velocity is a vector. It has both magnitude and direction to describe the velocity. It should require magnitude and direction. So magnitude of velocity means without direction you are taking. So magnitude of velocity is equals to speed. Speed is equals to magnitude of velocity. But only velocity means velocity and speed are not same. So only magnitude of velocity and speed are same. So speed of the car is 80 km per hour, magnitude of velocity is 80 km per hour, but velocity of the car is 80 km per hour from A to B means that you want to say magnitude and direction because velocity is a vector, it has a, a both magnitude and direction to describe the velocity, both magnitude and direction is required. Now units of speed in CCS system unit of speed is centimeter per second or you can also write this one centimeter second to the power of minus one but you can read as centimeter per second here also for velocity CCS unit is centimeter per second or you can write this one as centimeter per second like that second to the power of minus one you can read this one as centimeter per second in SI system its unit is meter per second. It can be written as meter second to the power of minus one. But reading means you can read meter per second. Meter per second or it can be written as meter second to the power of minus one. But you can call this one as a meter, meter per second. Bigger unit for measuring a speed. Bigger unit of speed. Bigger unit of speed is kilometer per hour. And here also bigger unit for measuring speed is kilometer per hour. So bigger unit of speed is kilometer per hour. Some more differences are there students. So now we are going to discuss those. Bigger units of speed and velocity are kilometer per hour. So, 1 kilometer per hour is equals to means that 1000 meters by hour means 3600 seconds. 2 zeros, 2 fives, 2 18. So, 5 by 18 meter per second. Here also 1 kilometer per hour is equals to 5 by 18 meter per second. So, to convert kilometer per hour into meter per second, the given value of kilometer per hour should be multiplied with 5 by 18. Here also same. Similarly, 1 meter per second is equals to 18 by 5 kilometer per hour. Here also 1 meter per second is equals to 18 by 5 kilometer per hour. So for converting meter per second into kilometer per hour, the given value of meter per second should be multiplied with 18 by 5. Now, so speed tells us speed tells us how fast a body moves how fast a body moves so speed can speak about the fastness of a body or slowness of a body so speed tells us how fast a body moves but velocity tells us tells us how fast a body moves with direction with direction but here so velocity is a vector so it tells about fastness of the body along with the direction but here only it, it, it tells how fast a body is moving how slow a body is a moving velocity tells about how fast a body is a moving how slow is a moving including direction so these are the differences between speed and velocity students that's all